Hi everybody, welcome to Graphic Design Tutorials brought to you by TechnoWatchPK.com. Today I am going to show you that how can we make this kind of particle dispersion effect in Photoshop. So let's get started. I have this nice image which I downloaded from Unsplash.com. If you want to use this image, the link of this image is given in description okay so let's get started first of all i'm going to make duplicate copy of this image by pressing ctrl j and then hide this layer and go to this layer and make the selection of our object i'm making selection with quick selection tool like this okay then i'm saving the selection by going to select and choosing save selection i'm naming it i am naming it woman click ok to save and now go to again go to select choose modify and expand i'm expanding by 25 pixels and then go to edit choose fill and keep the settings remain same and click ok to apply oh sorry the layer is locked so first we have to unlock this layer and then apply again go to edit choose fill and choose ok to apply content aware okay press ctrl d or go to select and choose deselect to deselect and now reveal this layer and go to select and choose lead load selection and choose selection which we made earlier woman and click ok to apply and again press ctrl j to make a duplicate copy of our selection and press ctrl j again to take another copy and now delete this layer and now go to this layer and apply filter liquify and stretch the image like this click ok to apply zoom in and now apply layer mask on both of these layers and choose this one and press ctrl i inverse and now press b i'll go to here and choose brush tool and choose any brush i am choosing this one and go to this layer Make sure that you are on this second layer and on mask and now it's hidden we have applied black color so the our our layer is hidden so make it white and start painting with your brush like this so to show the parts of little parts of your image like this one
and now increase the size of brush little bit by pressing right bracket key also you can change the angle of this and like this one press bracket key to make the to, to for variation press right and left bracket keys to increase and decrease the size of your brush You can choose any brush which you like. I like this brush, this square brushes. So I am applying this. It's up to you that which brush you like most. You can apply randomly. Sometimes decrease the size, sometimes choose the angle and stretch it little bit for variation like this. Now you can also paint with black to hide the some parts of these particles which we have created earlier 
which have we have created like this you can hide any part of these particles to give it more variation Again, paint with white to show the area of our masking image. Okay, and now go to this layer, and this layer is filled with white color, so we are showing all the area. Choose black color and paint over this with black so it will hide the parts of our image where wherever we will paint with our brush tool like this you can also paint it white to hide some area of our paint brush like this again paint it black okay so that's the tutorial for making particle dispersion effect in photoshop to if you want to remain updated with my upcoming videos please subscribe like and share and if you have any question suggestion or feedback feel free to comment below thank you for watching take care and bye bye